Ever wondered why fish don't get tired like us? Their hearts play a wild game of one-pass blood flow. But what happens when animals need turbocharged oxygen? Let's break it down as we explore single versus double circulatory pathways. A closed circulatory system is a type of circulatory system where substances such as oxygen, nutrients, and waste products are circulated in blood vessels. It is found in larger and more active animals, such as vertebrates, including humans, as well as some invertebrates like earthworms. This system is classified into two distinct circulatory pathways, the single circulatory pathway and the double circulatory pathway. First up, the single circulatory pathway, aka the one-stop shop of blood flow. Single circulatory pathway is found in fish. In this pathway, blood flows through a single circuit, meaning it passes through the heart only once during each complete cycle. Fish possess a two-chambered heart composed of one atrium and one ventricle. The process begins when the atrium collects deoxygenated blood from various parts of the body through the veins. This deoxygenated blood is then pumped into the ventricle. The ventricles in turn send it to the gills for oxygenation through the arteries. The gills serve as the site of gas exchange where oxygen is absorbed into the bloodstream and carbon dioxide is expelled. Once oxygenated, the blood flows directly to the rest of the body delivering oxygen and nutrients to tissues. After circulating through the body, the blood returns to the heart as deoxygenated blood. This completes the cycle. Because the blood passes through the heart only once, the oxygen supply to tissues is slower and less efficient compared to a double circulatory system. Let's gamify this. Imagine the heart is a two-player video game. Player 1, atrium, collects deoxygenated blood, and player 2, ventricle, pumps it to the gills for oxygen power-ups. But here's the twist. This system is slower at delivering oxygen to tissues, making fish the marathoners of the animal kingdom. Can you beat their endurance in a real-life swim challenge? Now, the double circulatory system. Double circulatory system is found in most vertebrates, including mammals, birds, and reptiles. This system features two distinct circuits, the pulmonary circuit and the systemic circuit, which work together to enhance the oxygenation of blood and the delivery of oxygen to tissues. The pulmonary circuit pathway carries deoxygenated blood from the heart to the lungs for oxygenation. The process begins with the right atrium, which collects deoxygenated blood from the body. This blood is then transferred to the right ventricle, which pumps it to the lungs via the pulmonary arteries. In the lungs, oxygen is absorbed into the blood and carbon dioxide is released. The now oxygen-rich blood flows back to the heart entering the left atrium. This blood is then transferred to the left ventricle, which pumps it to all the body parts. In the systemic circuit, oxygenated blood is pumped from the heart to all parts of the body. The heart in animals with a double circulatory system is four-chambered, consisting of two atria and two ventricles. The left ventricle receives the oxygenated blood from the left atrium. The ventricles pumps blood through the aorta to the rest of the body. As the oxygen is utilized by the body's tissues for cellular processes, the blood becomes deoxygenated. The blood is eventually returned to the heart, where it re-enters the pulmonary circuit. Now, a pop quiz. Which system do you think works best for an animal with high energy demands, like a cheetah chasing its prey? Drop your answers below and let's see how well you know your biology. To recap, a closed circulatory system is classified into two distinct circulatory pathways, the single circulatory pathway and the double circulatory pathway. The single circulatory pathway is found in fish. In this pathway, Blood flows through a single circuit, meaning it passes through the heart only once during each complete cycle. The pathway possesses a two-chambered heart composed of one atrium and one ventricle. Double circulatory system is found in most vertebrates including mammals, birds, and reptiles. In this pathway, blood flows through a double circuit, meaning it passes through the heart twice during each complete cycle. The pathway possesses a four-chambered heart composed of two atria and two ventricles.